in trying Lord. to ruin, trying to educate, Lord, Lord. inform our legislator, our congressman, our senators about this open source. Uh, have you been doing this or similar organizations like Dabawenyo? Yes, uh, us here in, in Dabawenyo, um, we've always been um, advocating the use of free and open source software. And the way we were doing it is through training. Uh, we partner with different schools, different organizations. Tapos ito promote kami ng use ng open source software. Um, kasi ang, ang nangyayari sa industry natin ngayon, <coughs> if you don't have the machinery to pay for the ads, mahirap ka mag-lobby ng... Yeah. Uh, so what we do is, we go to the grassroots, we teach them open source. But the our decision maker, have you lobbied? With no, the decision, you no. already did. No, we haven't. No, we haven't. Do you think that is uh, an appropriate uh, action to do, to lobby uh, the legislators, to have a meeting with them, a forum, uh, so that they will understand better what you're talking about? Yes, um, we spoke with, with Congressman uh, Casino, and we were urged or encouraged to write our um, local congressman and to encourage them to look at the bill and support the bill sa, for the good of the Philippines. Kasi po, ang, ang open source software, it's not just free, you know. Um, it, it's a software that that can evolve. Bakit po? Kasi po, lahat ng ingredients na yun Ang Filipino ay hindi kang creative talaga. And they're very savvy in, in IT. Yeah. So what we need to do is empower the Filipinos, yes. give them the software, give them the Give course. them the challenge. Yeah. And let them and Kasi, let pag, us improve it. Pag branded na, wala ng challenge. Wala na po. Kaginitin mo na lang. Di ba? Kaya hindi ka gaya ng open software. Our ECE like you, no, electronic communications engineer like you, will be challenged to uh, develop or to update or to make better no. the existing one. Anyway, uh, at, uh, uh, at this point, I'd like to uh, ask you a request.